Karibu tena baada kutoka kule madukani ndivyo tukaweze kujua baada ya ripoti ya daktari ya kwamba mchukue kipindi ama wachukue kipindi cha miaka mitatu kabla ya kufikiria kumpata mtoto mwingine kuliendaje je mm-hmm. mlifuata sheria na masharti hapo <laughs> sasa bwana kamiti mtihani nilinitoa jasho <laughs> tumeambiwa miaka tatu kwa sababu ndio kidonda kiwe kimepona yes. amepona vizuri mm-hmm. Lakini sasa hata mwaka huu kuisha in less than 6 months myofa me conceive aha eh yeah. less than 6 months amepata amekuwa mja mzito tena ah. eh yeah. ilikuwa around 4 months. months time na tuliambiwa miaka mitatu kwa sababu ya kidonda sasa hapa ni chini ya miezi sita <laughs> ni mja ni mja mzito, mzito. Eh. Na kwanza ndio tujue tulikakaa nasikia sa talent za kiafya. Yeah. Ndio sasa tulipoenda hospitali tukaambua ni mjamzito. We. Lipo ambua hivyo nilisikia kichwa kimenigonga. Kak kak. Sasa nikaona sasa nimehatarisha mke wangu. Tuliambua ni miaka tatu, ni miezi sita chini ya miezi sita sasa. Na mkapewa mpaka sababu za ni kwa nini? Na ni kwa nini? Wacha nisomewe. Na daktari. Eh, alinisomea. Alinisomea sana. Kanaambia wewe hauna huruma. Wewe utaki mke wako mazuri, nini unataka kuwa mke? Sasa hii kidonda. Sasa tulitoka hapo nikao nimeshushika moyo, moyo, nimeshushika moyo. Na pale nyuma wakati tulifanya hiyo kwa watu wale walikuwa nakuja wakiomba uh, kwa nyumba washirika wa kanisani kumbuka mama moja aliomba na akasema God tulipoambia Mungu amesema restore akasema God restore in a double portion wow. wapatie hata mapacha maombi ambayo ilikuwa nzito again nakumbuka nikimwambia Mungu baada ya kuhil na kupona yes. nikimwambia God thank you for trusting us with this pain and this trouble you have trusted us with the loss of pregnancy you have trusted us with the loss of a child mm. ulijua ya kwamba tuna imani ya kutosha kuweza kupitia hiyo mm. na ulitutengenezea njia ya kuweza kutokea mm. na unajitukuza mm. eh, katika hali zetu unajitukuza hatuja kuwa peke yetu oh, yeah. mm. sasa mayo afa me conceive eh, sasa nika conceive tena mm? Na nashukuru Mungu kwa sababu nilipo conceive nikakaa hizo four months nikiwa pregnant sikuwa najua. Mm-hmm. So sikuwa na wasiwasi. Mm-hmm. Sasa nikaka nika 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 nini? Kwanza nilienda hospitali my husband akani before sasa tujue sasa tuko pregnant. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Akaniambia niende hospitali. Kwenda hospitali zile results zilitoka zilitoka ya kwamba siko pregnant. Mm. Na ujue mm. niko four months pregnant, pregnant lakini results zilitoka si siko pregnant. Sasa kwanza huyo daktari alikuja akaniambia ah umesema hujapata period kwa miezi kadhaa nikamwambia yeye. Kwani ulikuwa mahali kuna joto ama baridi? Mm-hmm. Coincidentally nilikuwa nimetoka void tulikuwa tumeenda mission. Yeah. So nikamwambia na kidonda. Eh nikiwa mm-hmm. na kidonda. Mm-hmm. So nikamwambia E, nimetoka voi na huko sikuna joto sana so akaniambia eh hey, hiyo ndio reason ah. e, we gojea hilo dizitaku mm-hmm. kumbe am already pregnant And so ni, ni relax yeah. lakini siku moja niliamka hivi asubuhi nikasema hii si kawaida kuna venye mtu akiwa pregnant unasikia okay na i was convinced i am pregnant nikamwambia my husband I'm pregnant na from there to confirm nilikuwa pregnant sasa ndio sasa daktari na maneno zake akatwambia akatwambia hii mimba isipitishe six months, months. ukifikisha six months ukuja tutoe hii mimba kwa sababu haiwezi ka survive kwa kwa umbu yako utapasuka okay. reason ya kupasuka ni nini umeconceive haraka sana hiyo kidonda imepona juu lakini ndani haijapona So the mom toto ana grow the mom the mom inaenda iki 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 eh yeah, ikiwa week akatwambia itapasuka na tukawa tumeambiwa hivyo 6 months 6 months 
turudi mimi baitolewe so tukarudi tukiwa tumeshushika moyo tukiwa down lakini sasa kama watumishi wa Mungu nini nyingine tunajua isipokuwa kuomba kuomba tu tukaanza kuomba tukaanza kuomba tukaanza kuomba kuomba katika hiyo hali ya kuomba Mungu alitunenea nikasema alitunenea Isaiah 66:9 mhm eh uh-huh. ya kwamba yeye aleti katika kuzaa na akose kupeana nguvu ya kujifungua mm-hmm. Na Isaiah 669. Na yeye anapeana conception. Yes. Tulianza kuomba na hayo maandiko. Mm-hmm. Tukiomba Mungu umesema wewe uwezi kupeana ujauzito mm-hmm. na ulete katika mahali pa kuzaa mm-hmm. na ukose kupeana nguvu ya kuzalisha. Mm-hmm. This pregnancy will not be terminated. Mm-hmm. It will go to maturity. Mm-hmm. Hii mimba nikawa sana naekelea mke wangu mikono. Namwambia hii mimba itafika miezi tisa na tutapata mtoto mm. na tukawa tukimkumbusha Mungu Mungu lisema wewe ni Mungu wa urejesho mm. huu ndio urejesho unatupatia mm. wewe ni mwaminifu kutimiza neno lako mimba hii tatimia huu urejesho tunaongojea mm. hii mimba haitatoka mm. maneno tukaanza kukanusha maneno ya daktari mm. ya miezi sita kuyakanusha kuyakanusha kila asubuhi nilikuwa nikiamka na mwekelea mikono mm. Ninamwombea, ninatabiria wewe mtoto ambaye uko hapo ndani, ukue vyema, ukue vizuri bila matatizo. Mke wangu asitatizike kwa chochote. Mm. Tunanena, tunazungumza. Mm. Na namna hiyo. So, eh? wakati wakati tuliendelea kuomba, mm. sasa sisi mm. imani yetu imejengeka. Mm. Sasa shida ni kwenye tunafaa kurudi hospitalini. Hospitali. Yes. Sasa kurudi pale hospitalini. Ah tukaambia daktari sisi hatutoi mimba. mimba. <laughs> Kaleta fujo tena. <laughs> Alileta shida akatoa hicho eh. kifile. Mm. Akasema mimi kesi yenu mm. siwezi kuihandle. No. Akaandika hapo juu mm. mother at risk yes. na retas kubwa. Mm. Mother at, at risk. risk na akatutuma msikue mnakuja hapa twendeni pumuani. Mm. So mimi nilipochukua hiyo <coughs> hiyo hiyo file yenye nilipewa alipo nilipoona imeandikwa mother at risk nikaanza kusema kui, ku, ku, kunena hapo mm. nikasema i am not at, at risk. risk in yes. the name of jesus, jesus imeandikwa i am at risk but i am not at risk mm. in the name of jesus so mm. hiyo hospitali tukaachana hivyo kama ameshindwa sasa hawa ni watu aina gani tukaenda hospitali kubwa pumwani tulipoenda huko tukaanza clinic na madaktari si wanabadilishana hivyo hivyo mnawaambia si wana already imeandikwa kwa nini kwa file, kwa file. Yes. yes okay eh mm-hmm. ilikuwa ni faro leta tukanini wanaona process yetu na nini yes. tukaendelea tukaendelea ah nimebeba mimba mara kadhaa lakini kama kuna mimba nili, nilibeba na sikuwa ikuwa na shida yoyote ni hiyo mimba even at six months Eh yeah. ilish isha pita 6 months sasa nothing happened yeah. nothing happened hakuna hata kutoa mtoto mimba ina grow vizuri tumetumwa pumwani huko ndiko tunatengenezewa sasa Nina, ninaenda clinic huko hakuna shida yoyote sikuwai hata jikuna hata kuashwa hata nini now kufika miezi nane mm-hmm. tulipofikisha miezi nilipofikisha miezi nane mimi nikaanza kusikia ai hii movement yenye ninasikia kwa hii tumbo sio mtoto mmoja Sasa ndio nilikuwa mkubwa sana mkubwa sana so nilikuwa nasikia mtoto anachezea hapa na anachezea hapa Sasa nikawa tunafanya ma- mahesabu zangu tu hata kama huyu mtoto ni mrefu ameweza kuwa na huu urefu wote okay. Na kabla hapo <laughs> alianza kutaja kabla tujue alianza kutaja mapacha Sasa nikamwambia wacha kuongea mambo ya mapacha sina ne Neema Sina mapacha. neema ya hiyo mapacha. <laughs> <laughs> Sina neema na unajua maneno yako wewe ni mteule iko na iko na nguvu. Mm. So sasa hapo ndio tulienda. Dakte... Neema? Sina neema ya mapacha. <laughs> Aje kuzungumza yeye ni mteule. Yeah. Maneno yake iko na nguvu. Sasa uh-huh. ndio kufika hospitali madaktari waka confirm mm. e, e, kupiga hivi daktari anasema anasikia hati bit ya watu wawili. Jua niambia niguze, nikaguza nikasikia kuna kichwa hapa na kichwa hapa. Ndio daktari aka confirm tukatuma scan kwenda scan huko hiyo ika confirm tuko na mapacha na ni vijana ni vijana wawili baada ya kuconfirmiwa hiyo sasa si ndio kurudi nyumbani sasa nikaanza nikasema sasa i through 
alisema ata restore he has restored in a double portion, double portion. so i accept ngambia mm. mungu eh, nisamehe mm. kwa kuku doubt na maneno niongea sasa nipe neema ya kulea hawa wa mapacha so walikuja tulipo wapata mko wangu akupeleka kwa kwa theater yeah. maana alienda CS pia eh, baada ya kufanywa kupata hawa watoto uh, daktari waliomfanya siwezi walimwambia ni kibaki kibaki mm. kwa hiyo akajua ni wawi nikakuwa kwa mfana ni vijana mm-hmm. alipopelekwa kwa ward si watoto watakuja analetoa mtoto tena mmoja eh? eh. anaambua wewe ni mama ufurahi wewe ni mama kijana mmoja alileta shida sasa mimi nilipata mapacha watoto wawili leteni mtoto wangu wa pili akaleta fujo naoma daktari wengine walikuwa hapo wanasikia juni nasi alikuwa analeta huyu mmoja wakamwambia hapana ulipata wawili huyo mwingine alienda akaletwa mhm huyo e, mtoto wa pili alienda akaletwa mungu, mungu alitupanguza machozi alivuta machozi yetu akatubariki na watoto twins ambao sasa ni wakubwa watu wazima 17 years old can imagine in form 3 mm. na tunashukuru Mungu na umewalea tu vizuri bila shida <laughs> bila shida sipokuwa hiyo <laughs> shida mmoja alikuwa anapotea hospitali yeah. at three years mmoja alikuwa tena ameibiwa <laughs> na nani <laughs> na mtu kwa plot wakati tunatoka kwenda church wametremka kwa stairs kumbe jamaa mmoja aliingia kwa plot ni kama alikuwa analenga lenga ameshika huyu mmoja kamfunika mdomo na akajificha kwa stairs. Kai. Sasa my wife anaitana anaona mtoto mmoja anaitwa mwingine huyu mwingine hawezi kuitika amefungwa mdomo. Kurudi kwa stairs ndio anakutana na jamaa ameshika mtoto. Ah unafanya mtoto wangu jamaa akatoka mbio. Ai. Sasa tunaona kati ya kuzaliwa mmoja alikuwa anaenda. Sasa akikuwa kwa 3 years mwingine anataka tena anataka ara kuibiwa amefungwa mdomo. Shindo, Lakini Mungu amewalinda. Wow. He also spoke to us concerning them. Akasema they are special children to him they are and he is going to take good care of them mm. he promised us and he said he is going to educate them hey. and i want to tell you tumeona mkono wa mungu mm. na neema yake mungu anawasomesha mm. mwenyewe kwa njia zake tu kwa njia zake mungu anawasomesha mm. anatimiza ahadi yake ile alitwambia atawasomesha they are special to him and later a baby girl and later, later <laughs> baby girl tuko tumefunga chapter <laughs> tumesema tulea hawa wawili mm na tumekubaliana mm. lakini Mungu aliona aitoshi mm. alete so akasema mguu into restore nini ni nyinyi mm. eh yeah. yeah. <laughs> sasa akatuletea msikana yeah. hata ukiangalia gap hilo ameachana nayo yeah. it's a big gap yeah. 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 around 10 years 9 9 years 9 years okay huyu mguu mshafunga kama nini kwa tulikuwa tushasema in fact done in fact hata ni kusahau madaktari walisahau tulikuwa tumekubaliana yeye mm-hmm. akitoka kwa dieta mm-hmm. amefungwa mm-hmm. wapi <laughs> ikasaulika hapo <laughs> yeah. kwa sababu yeah. msichana amekuja ile ningependa kukuhimiza na kukutia moyoni kwamba usiwahi kosa tumaini hold on to hope hold on to faith wait upon god kwa sababu wakati wake unafika amen anasema ya kwamba the expectations of the righteous will not be cut off amen. keep amen. on expecting keep on hoping keep on holding on faith ni kwa sababu at the appointed time of god yeah. god will do will do it hallelujah alitutendea sisi oh yes akatupata na msichana ambaye hata hatukuwa tunatarajia mm. na tuko na furaha tukishuhudia matendo makuu ya Mungu amen so take heart usiwai lose hope yes e, hata ikikaa miaka ngapi don't lose hope don't give up wait upon god ah uh, nimejua that there is no life that god cannot rebuild mm. There's no life that God, God cannot rebuild. Hakuna mm. maisha ambayo Mungu hawezi kutengeneza mm. na kuunda tena. Amen. Hata kama inaonekana imetawanyika namna gani, Amen. Mungu anaweza kuirejesha Amen. na kuileta na kuileta pamoja. Amen. Na ametuambia he will not abandon us in our situations. Si amesema hata tukipitia kwenye moto, mm-hmm. yuko pamoja nasi. Mm-hmm. Hata tukipitia kwenye maji mengi, oh, yes. hata tugarikia. Oh, yes. Anaweza kuo kuonekana is removed from the scene mm. but is Jehovah Shama. Ndio naona tujitana Jehovah Shama yes. na Shalom. Kutukumbusha tuliwaita hao tukumbushange. Yeah. It was Jehovah Shama. He was present in our situations. Yes. Jehovah Shalom is the Lord of peace. Amen. Ametupatia uh, amani. Amen. Ni Mungu mwema na tunafurahia na tunamtumikia. Wow. Amen. Asante. He 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 he. Amen. <laughs> Wow. Kamete is my very good name. Those two seasons 
episodes amazing. Hata sitaongea kitu kingine. Bye. Kwaheri. Thank you.